Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem 62 in chapter 16. Chapter 16 is about sound wave. There we talk about the Doppler effect. You can see we have the two objects, one bat and another one object. And the frequency for the source, the bat, is given at zero. And we know the object move away from this bat 30 meters per second, right? This is what tell us. And then we need to find what is the frequency received by the sound frequency of the bat. So now let's see how it happens. First one, this is we can consider it as a source, right? This is stationary source. And then it just uh, produces the waves, sound waves. And then the object can be considered as a moving observer. Do you agree? And this uh, moving uh, uh, observer just uh, move away from the source. So these problems can be the observer moving uh, away from the stationary source. So which function we can choose? This one. Agree? So now this is a frequency the object received. So a frequency f object plus. And then use this equation, we can get the f. This is a source by the bat. Now we can see the second time when this object received the frequency f object plus, and then it will return the sound wave to the bat. Ask you what is the frequency the bat received. So in this object, we can see because the source comes from the object, right? It returned. So this can be the source. This is a moving source. Agree? And this uh, can be becomes observer, the bat. It is a stationary observer. So it can, can be the source is moving away from the stationary stationary observer because it moves this way. So source moving away from the stationary observer. We select this ob object, this function, right? So this frequency produced by the object is f object plus, right? And this is the frequency, the byte received, f byte plus, and use this equation. Now we need to combine these two equations together. We get the function look like this one. You can see the f byte frequency. This is the frequency, the byte received, equals to this function. Inside this function, you can see f is given. The um, velocity of the object is given 30 meters, agree? 30 meters. Now, this frequency is given at zero. What is the velocity for the sound? This one, it is a common sense. Three, four, three meter per second. Now you input all these quantities, get answer there. Thank you.